Hey guys, it's Blair the Love Guru from loveguru.net and alienetwork.com and it's really fucking hot every single day because, you know, this was on the agenda, right? We talked about it in the beginning of July. Actually, at the end of June, we talked about it. Magic, come over here. They didn't announce anything about the heat, but the heat wave that we're having, I mean, you can't possibly think that this is natural. I don't. I know. So today we're going to talk about, what are we talking about? I seem to have my topic and then I forgot about it. Um, there's nothing cute about ignorance. There's nothing cute about ignorance or really, I guess the saying is there's nothing cute about denial. That's what Zeke has been saying to me for the last uh, few days. Ooh, sexy. It's my bra. Um, oh, what kind of angle should we be at? Okay. That's what Zeke has been talking to me about the last, uh, I guess it's been over a week now because all what I could think about is how it's the end of days. Um, which is not exactly a positive thought, you know? It, it's not uh, exactly like a, a happy thought. It's not exactly like a thought that, you know, like it brings anxiety, like it brings some fears and um, concerns and um, some tears at times. Yeah, I mean, it definitely brings up emotions at times. And it's, it's weird because I will listen to some fellow light workers, um, which I have talked about how if you're an indigo warrior, um, you can call yourself a light worker, but you're really not a light worker. Like, well, we should, we need to like specify what these words mean. And I talk about this, uh, in the products that I offer on my website, thealiennetwork.com, uh, because I'm not giving out all this information for free anymore, you know? This is my work, and I am honoring the energy that I put out, and um, I hope that you continue on this journey with me, because um, if you want to learn, you have to pay. Not always, but yeah, that's how it that's how it works to accelerate. That's how you honor other people. You do an exchange. So I talk about how indigos are different than than light workers. We're not light workers, but you know, I hear a lot of these light workers talking, and they say maybe they they know about um, the new world order but they don't really know about it obviously because they're just all like ah, put on a mask and it's like if you know about the new world order like you're not putting on a mask and uh, they're all like oh it's gonna be fine you know that kind of thing or like oh like we'll be fine once we get the vaccine it's like what so there's definitely this division amongst the spiritual community. I mean, I'm I'm definitely feeling it. Like I don't I, I don't feel attracted at all to these type types of light workers that are like completely clueless. And really, I just feel like being around my tribe, my indigo warriors. Um, and not all of them, you know, because there's plenty of clueless indigos. <laughs> and there's there's plenty of indigos that are still like day and night just work 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 and um, not doing their mission and um, also totally clueless that you know we're experiencing the end of times <laughs> it's like you know it's like if it's if it was the end of times like would you want to know and I, I kind of play around with this because um, I try like part of me plays with that idea of like First, did I go into like a negative timeline? Am I like not seeing things clearly? And I'm always like asking this question and Zeke always says to me, Blair, there's nothing attractive about denial. Um, there, you know, these people are ignorant as far as what's going on or they're in denial. And that's a big issue that the spiritual community has is they love hanging out in denial. And um, I'm seeing it pop up all over the place. And at first it was very confusing.
confusing to me because I was like, that's not the messages I'm getting intuition wise and how Zeke is guiding me. I mean, I'm looking into and I've been um, doing like prepping and survival stuff and protection stuff. And uh, you could uh, assume what that means, okay? I, I'm not gonna go into it uh, so much here. Uh, you know, again, I have this, I have some products that I just put up about um, prepping protection and survival for spiritual people and clearing the gunk that we have surrounding that. And you can get that on the aliennetwork.com. But, you know, I see people, everyday people, just, you know, posting on Facebook about how they're going out to eat or how, you know, sign up for this program and learn how to make money or, uh, you know, learn how to balance your hormones or find the one. I mean, I, t I teach all that stuff. You know, that stuff has merit. But, like, we're... We're fighting for our survival right now. Like, do you not realize this? Like, I don't understand how anyone can talk about anything but this. But yet the whole world, I mean, we're not just talking about spiritual people, but yet the whole world is like completely clueless. I'll leave it at that. <laughs>